All right, guys, what's going on? Jamie here. Just wanted to cover the latest update from Forex on the relaunch of Piggy Bank. Um, he just posted over on his Telegram. I'll go over that here in a second. Um, but yeah, you can see here, Drip is having some nice price movement. It's at $37.36. So um, yeah, this thing is uh, moving in the right direction. And uh, we'll see. We'll see when this thing launches next week or relaunches rather what the price of drip is going to be but yeah drip has been the the rock in the DeFi space over the last year this thing has been running for a year and um <laughs> pretty amazing stuff guys pretty amazing stuff if you don't have a position in drip i will leave my buddy here just down below you want to check it out uh, but drip is kind of the main hub of everything else we're doing as you can see i kind of get into different platforms and projects but i always come back to drip because that's the main the main uh the main hub for lack of a better term so let's go over this um this post right here drip kicking butt of course it goes without saying i should have said this earlier but everything i talk about on my channels for entertainment purposes only definitely not giving you financial advice you should do your own research your own due diligence and if you want to get in after that and you feel like you can tolerate the risk only put in funds you can afford to lose guys all right so let's cover this. This is the update. He just posted this a couple of minutes ago. It says here, we brought in a third party who specializes in advanced math to go over all of our work on the piggy bank. And we will be final, finalizing all of the numbers today. As I said in the last interview, we will wait until 100% of the work is finished until we set a launch date. This, was, uh, this way we will never again feel forced to make a last minute decision in order to meet a deadline. All the coding is 100% finished. We have enough pigs from the credit event to do 100% migration. And all that is left is to finalize the numbers which we are handling today. In our quest to always improve, we made some slight changes to our development process, which we, which we took time, but we are more confident than ever in our ability to push the development with security in the forefront. This includes bringing on an additional developer whose main focus is quality control. So this is all good stuff, guys, right? If you want, if you want a platform or, uh, you know, if you want something long term, you want to make sure that things are handled correctly. There's nothing rushed. We've seen different contracts and different platforms, you know, have, you know, exploits and all sorts of stuff because they just rushed something and, you know, put it out to the market and it wasn't ready yet. Right. So, um, you know, this is taking a little bit longer than we expected. But cool thing is, you know, while they're, you know, while they're uh, taking care of this. You know, Drip is doing its thing and all the funds are safe, right? Um, says here yesterday, we had a meeting about the scratch ticket model, which we talked about previously in another video and have made serious progress. We know this, the scratch ticket model is a high demand product that is extremely sustainable, but through the power of DeFi, we have really taken the protocol to the next level by giving a use case to the scratch ticket. Um, in Drip's case, it's gonna be NFTs, uh, which were not winners. This use case ensures that by ticket, you buy a ticket, not only do you have the chance to win multiple prizes, just like a standard scratch ticket model, but also share of the protocol itself. This adds a new element of demand to the scratch ticket model for serious investors, which can only be done through DeFi. Um, this will not, excuse me, this will not only be a major standalone project, but it will also bring in a major new capital flow into drip, dogs, and pigs. As a percentage of all BNB used to buy the tickets, will go directly to supporting these assets. So again, you know the, the scratch ticket model is going to support the other tokens in the ecosystem, which is good. I will be making an official piggy bank launch date for next week as soon as we finalize a third-party review of our numbers. But right now, we are looking at Thursday as the most probable day, as we will we will try to finalize everything today and then give ourselves a full week of heavy promotion with the announcement launch date. So. Most probable date is Thursday. We'll see. Might might be Friday, uh, Thursday, Friday, something like that towards the back end of the week. Um, so we'll see what happens there. So, you know, Forex uh, doing a bunch of work behind the scenes. He has a a new member of the dev team. They're doing everything. They're crossing all the T's, dotting all the I's, making sure everything's, you know, done correctly. So that's good to know. Um, yeah. Yeah, very, very exciting stuff, guys. Okay. So we'll see what happens. You know, Forex is, has, you know, he has a really, really good track record. Obviously, to have a platform that's run just solidly for the last year, 
Um, obviously, he's he's a long term thinker, and um, I think he, you know he's putting the same thought process into all the different facets of the ecosystem as well. So yeah, so Drip is doing its thing. Let's take a quick look at uh, Trunk Stampede. Um, I talked about this yesterday in my video. Yeah, but this is a uh, this is doing its thing. You know, with a, with with a with this uh, platform that revolves around stables, you know, market can go down, and pretty much this is a hedge against that. So we're making passive income, regardless if the market goes down. It's good to have a couple of different things in your portfolio. When the market is pumping and drip is going up, we're making crazy crazy grains gains with drip. When the market goes through a correction and it, and goes through a somewhat of a dump, obviously this platform here is a hedge against that. So that's pretty good. And then last but not least, have Piston Token sitting at $13.47. Um, so this is kind of doing its thing. So someone told me that the airdrop, this, this right here, this airdrop is going to launch on April 11th. This is my video I was talking about. You know, I didn't know how to do an airdrop or a multiple airdrop where you can do one transaction and everybody in your first level uh, divvies up your airdrop. So it looks like April 11th is when they're going to have that available. So we'll be able to do an airdrop at that point. Um, but this one here is, you know, doing its thing. It's very, very new. We'll see what happens here. Um, if you want to check this out, I will leave my buddy link for this down below as well. So that's pretty much it, guys. Just wanted to go over that update for Forex. Things are going well. Market's going to go up. Market's going to go down. You have to find ways to profit, regardless if the market is going up, down, sideways, whatever. These platforms are, are doing good. So that being said, follow me on Telegram, subscribe to the channel, hit the little bell icon, all that good stuff, and I'll catch you on the next video. Peace.